Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Pioneer Slivers. And we lost the die roll, unfortunately, against uh, 101 Demons. Uh, but let's check out our hand here. We got a one lander. That's unfortunate. I don't think we can keep this, otherwise the hand looks decent. But I don't think we can survive off of this, unfortunately. So we're going to mulligan. And we're going to mulligan. And... <laughs> Oh boy. Alright, well, we'll keep. We're gonna dump the collected company. All we need is one land. We can start going off with the mana swap. I think we just dropped the bone scythe here. These four cards should be enough to close out a game if we can pull into a land here. We are on the draw. So let's see what we can do. Hey guys, make sure to subscribe if you haven't yet. So we're trying to get to the. 1k point so maybe i can make some money off of these videos a little bit of chump change or something but i'd appreciate it if you do subscribe um if you do enjoy the videos so uh, make sure to do that please leave a like if you do enjoy them and yeah we're gonna pass back to 101 demons see if they're gonna kill our gale rider they have a mute vault uh oh is this a zombie deck pack rats ah rat rat rats that's not pretty, but we got our land. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. I think because we're up against some black, I kind of just want to go diffusion, and the next turn we can go off with like a mana swift play. Pack rat, though. That might be tough, but I think we got this. I think we got this. Let's do it. Come on. What you got for me? Might be regretting not playing the removal now. Who knows? I mean, at this point, they could fatal push something still and then kill my diffusion or something. Kill my Gale Rider. All right. Dumping Blood Chief's Thirst. It's a good card from Zendikar. They're going to create a token. They're going to get some more power. We got another land not bad not bad not bad let's go mana swept into we'll do our lord just get some creatures down swing in for two we're racing tribal versus tribal trying to race it out go ahead next turn we can do the leeching and swing in with a Muta Vault. See if they go for another discard here. Uh, if so, we're just taking six. They're going to take a lot more next turn. It's going to get sketchy, though. Unclaimed. All right, so we'll play our leeching. Now they're swinging in for quite a bit. I think we're gonna just hold back the Muta Volt on chump blocking duty, just in case. We'll have two blockers. Gonna be close. I'm just wondering if they've got any like combat tricks to push through extra damage. Cost three. Are they doing this pre-combat? They are doing this pre-combat. Alright. What else you got? Anything else? You're gonna make the Muta Vault into a creature? He's gonna make the Muta Vault a creature. Okay. But they are tapped out, so we just need to block 
We do need to block two of these things. So we'll just block, block. Take the damage, and then we'll swing in for lethal. Look at how close of a game that was. Five and five right now, but we're going to game two. Sideboard time. Fatal push, come here. I like it. Um, didn't we saw the one removal in their hand? Shapers, I think, is fine. I think siphon fill uh, sliver will be great. Pithing needle just to stop their pack rat completely. We can take out a mortal. We can take out an icon. We need to cut a lot. I'll cut a bone scythe. Metallic, a couple of metallics. Two more. Hmm. I want the diffusions. This game is going to go fast, so maybe there's a reason we cut Hive Lord here. Need to cut one more thing. Icon Sentinel. Sentinel will be good for defense. Striking, I think they'll outpace our striking a bit, so maybe we just take him out. Mm, it's debatable. I don't really want to. I think we're going to cut one more metallic. No, we'll keep it in the metallic. We'll cut a, we'll cut a sanctuary. We'll cut a sanctuary. Sorry, I, my reasoning for cutting like sanctuary is we do just want to race and playing sanctuaries over like a creature might not be the best thing. This should be a great hand. I'm gonna come, oh, that's dirty right there. Oh, that's dirty. Okay, let's go sliver. We don't have to take damage unless we need to really. Gale Rider, and we'll start popping off with the diffusions, and then drop that Siphon Sliver Bomb, and it'll be pretty nasty. And if we can get a Thought Seize. Well, there goes our Siphon. If they're smart, they'll take their si the Siphon, I think. Yeah. What else you got in there? You got another one? Yeah, Fatal Push now, sure. We got our own Fatal Push. Um, let's just go Mutavolt. Go ahead. Murderous Radar. It's nice. Two, three. Okay, all right, we're, we're, we're doing things. We're doing things over here. We got a nice uh, predatory to come in handy. Let's, I think we're just gonna go ahead and drop another diffusion first though. Play this out tapped, go to them. Muta Vault, trying to get in on the attack while he can. Take the four. There's the pack rat. I don't have a lot to discard though. All right, so. Oops, undo. And then we can... Which is the one I played? This one? Good, good, good. We can start getting in for our own damage a little bit. Boom, bang, bang. The race begins. Time to start discarding. Mm, decisions. Right. 
They dumped a swamp for that. Seems reasonable. Take the four here. Sliver Hive. Need a way to play this fatal push, that'd be really nice. We'll go like this. Apply the pressure. I love a Gale Rider or something. Bolus is Citadel. They're playing with this. Yikes. Uh, okay. So we die? <laughs> we just die. Sacrifice 10 non land. Per okay, we don't die yet. Non land, non land. Gotta remember that though. Just here. Man, we are not getting great results with our stuff, which is unfortunate. Let's get in there for a little bit. They do have zero cards in hand, something we gotta keep in mind. Pass through. Nope. Okay, good. Sacred Foundry down. Let's keep going. See what they drew. They are at three, so now defense is uh, it's gonna be up here a little bit. with one card. Sentinel's pretty nice here, not gonna lie. Get a nice Sentinel going. And then how do we want to do this here? They can activate Muta Vaults. They can discard a card. So they have very reasonable locks. Okay, we'll sit back for, for a turn here. Uh, it doesn't seem worth it to swing in unless we got the lethal really here. And we do not have it quite yet. They're gonna keep pack ratting. Gary, oh my gosh. Does that kill us? That like definitely kills us, right? One, two, three, four. I don't even know. It, it kills us. <laughs> There's no way that doesn't kill us. <laughs> yeah. All right. Game three, I guess. That was a close one too. Anything different we want to do? I'm, like, I'm not even worried about sh shapers anymore. What will we bring in instead? Dude, this is the second game. I win one, they win one, they leave. Why doesn't anybody want to finish out the best of three? I don't know. I don't understand it. I don't understand it at all. Why don't you want to finish out the best of three, guys? This is my second recording for the day, and this... I went against, uh, what, what was it? Gogari Counters, you know? Uh, Walking Ballista Counters Company, whatever it's called. And same thing. I don't even know if I want to post it when they do that, you know? Yeah, it's good gameplay, but then all of a sudden it's like they leave. Why? Finish out the game, man finish out the game well hopefully you guys enjoyed that one it was a cool matchup um i would have loved to have seen where the game three would have went 
Uh, I probably was going to bring in a Metallic Mimic or something, or maybe our Bone Scythe at this point. But, uh, yeah, leave a like on the video if you enjoyed that one. Hopefully, uh, hopefully next game I record they can actually stay in. But, uh, yeah. All right, well, stay tuned for more Pioneer Slivers and Popper Slivers in the future here. And we will see you guys in the next video.